Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Snack and Smack, the show where we eat snacks and talk smack. I'm your host, Simon Klein. Today's guest is Love Gina. Hey, what's up, guys? On today's episode, we're going to be trying out instant hot pot. Y'all ready for this? Let's, Let's snack! snack. Oh, it's steaming up! Instant Hot Pot. This is crazy. I think this is a brand new product. I just bought this at the grocery store. So I found this, uh, I think it's like less than $10. But imagine, Instant Hot Pot. You're late at night right now. There's yeah. nothing to eat. There's nothing open. And imagine if you had this baby inside your cabinet. <laughs> yeah, I freaking love Hot Pot. It's like a really... Um, interactive and engaging style of eating and like it's something that you could do together you know absolutely I mean remember growing up for myself there's like a uh, different style of hot pot there's like Japanese style mm -hmm. there's like Chinese style Vietnamese style but the cool thing about it is like you can put anything in a hot pot like from vegetables yeah. to meat the carbs to, to whatever that you want to put in it and you share it and I remember growing up like if you don't wash after your food right imagine you're cooking it you don't wash after somebody's gonna steal your fish ball or whatever it's yeah <laughs> So let's check out what's on the inside here guys. Um, this is a vegetarian hot pot. I think there's different styles though. This one's made by Heidi Lau. Heidi Lau is a very popular uh, hot pot spot in uh, China. And I actually went to the flagship store in Beijing recently. It's so cool because actually the one inside Beijing, and there's a lot of robots that serve you food. Yeah. That's wild. It's like the Jetsons. Yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> so imagine like you're ordering from an iPad, right? Mm -hmm. You select your meats and different products. And then there's robot arm that pulls out these little trays and you put it on another robot. And that robot goes directly to your table and you pulled out from the and it speaks Chinese to you. Uh, so it's kind of like dim sum but with robots. Oh, without the people. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy because in America, robots only give you parking tickets. <laughs> so let's see. It takes 50 minutes to see what's on the inside of here. Maybe you can show us what the greetings are. All right. So the first thing we have is utensils. Ooh. It has chopsticks and a spoon. It comes fully equipped. Nice. Um, some bean vermicelli. Ooh, bean vermicelli. Oh, it's like the little clear thin noodles, right? Oh wow, it comes so with cool. a heating bag so it keeps it hot for you. No, it's actually the agent that heats it up for you. So you, when oh, you it pour it, up yeah. For you. So the, this is a little package right here. Uh, so this is like the MRE right here. All you have to do is just uh, open this up, put it at the bottom of the tray, and then pour water in. It's like, you know, the hand warmers? Yeah, like during the winter, for you sure. crack it open and you like, But you could pour room temperature water in it? Yes, oh, room okay, temperature. Not it. even boiling water, room temperature water and it in here. It heats it up for you. Yep. And it, bo it boils. So it boils up the pot. Uh, the package for you, so that that's really insane. cool. We have um, spicy flavor hot pot seasoning. Nice, number one. So it actually labels each package for you guys. Um, I guess. This oh, is this is a tray. Oh, this is a serving tray here. Oh, that's cool. So you put all the stuff in here. Yes. And then it heats at the bottom. Yep, exactly, okay, exactly. Um, we got vegetables. Ooh, number five, number three, number three vegetables are here. And we have some more vegetables. Oh, cool. So these are all the ingredients right here. So there are six packages in here. Um, and the little heating tray, this is what it looks like on the inside. So this is all the components that it comes with. Now that we have all the greenness laid out here, we have like different packages from the utensils to the heating package and now all the different spices like from the broth to the vegetables. And this right here is actually the container that you put everything into and this is the, the full container that you put the water into here. So I'm going to have Gina go ahead and open up each package. So this is the bowl right here. So why don't you go ahead and open up uh, one, two, three, and four. Alright. Yeah. So this would go at the bottom first. No, for right? this one, actually we're putting in this one right here. We're putting all of it in that. Yeah, okay, so not it. this one. This is actually the heating container that you put the water into, but this is the bowl that you want to put all the ingredients uh, into this one right here. So I guess the first one, what is this? A uh, spicy... spicy seasoning. Oh, wow. Okay, that's all it goes. <laughs> It smells like la, the lao gong ma sauce. Oh, like the, the, the mala chili, stuff? Yeah, oh, chili oil like. sauce. Oh, that's super strong. Wow. All right. You can definitely smell like the spices in there. It definitely has, oh, it's like oil. The mm -hmm. chili oil. oil. Base. Has like the mala peppercorns in there and all the chili spices. Now we're just missing ice oh, cream. Oh, there's like little chunks in there. Huh? Oh, there, oh, there's like huge chunks in there. Oh, wow. Yeah, it does look like lao gan ma or that chili oil. That's crazy. Number two. Number two is vegetables. Ooh, what kind of vegetables is that? What is like that? Seaweed, lotus roots. Oh, cool. Oh yeah. Oh wow. Wow. Okay, so that's the second package here. It has different ingredients. It comes with the lotus roots. It comes with the seaweed. I think potatoes in there? Mushrooms? Mushrooms? Is that ginger or? 
Oh, I don't know. Let's actually see. So this is the utensils package right here. Oh, this looks pretty cute. Oh, let's see what's inside of here. Oh, so it comes with chopsticks, uh, a spoon, okay, a toothpick. <laughs> that's pretty unique. Wow. Yeah, that's very considerate. Oh, they're yeah. giving you a toothpick on there. Oh, no, oh, this is so cool. And a so, two straw. No, it's not a straw. So actually in uh, Asia, a lot of times the chopsticks that they give you, um, this is what I noticed in China, right? So you basically take these right here and you put it in here as an extension. Oh, so you don't like hurt your fingers or no, splinters? It, no, I don't know. It's just like an extension to make it clean, I guess wow, it is. Okay. Yeah, so this is how you do it. You put it on the top right here and this is the chopstick. Let's see what the number three is. All right. Oh, that's a, it's a pretty pack. It's a pretty big portion. Oh, 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 it's more It's more the same vegetables. Yeah, for sure. Oh, okay. So I'm assuming that because it is a vegetarian one, it comes with two of the same. And maybe like the, the meat version of this, it comes maybe the third package is like a meat base. But it's the same thing. It has all the it's, different mushrooms and a different seaweed on here. The meat is pre-cooked, right? I, I would assume so. Yeah, yeah. I would hope so, right? <laughs> Oh man, have you ever had lotus roots in your hot pot? Yeah, I it's love delicious. Lotus it's like a nice crunch on there. So that's the third package. It's the same as the second one. Now let's see what the fourth one is. Right, and we got bean vermicelli. A so I mean vermicelli is just like clear thin noodles on there, uh, and I guess this was made out of beans. I didn't. I actually didn't know that was made out of so beans. So do we add it now? Yeah, let's add it now. Okay. So it has oh, package one, two, three, and four. All right. Just add it on top right there. Do you like vermicelli or do you like more of like the like the Vietnamese rice noodles? I love rice noodles and egg noodles. Now that we have all the ingredients inside of the clear bucket right here, which is uh, made out of plastic, uh, we're gonna pour 400 milliliter of hot water. So Gina, why don't you pour it inside? Okay. There's actually a little line at the top right there. So pour 400 milliliter water as a little line, so this way you don't mess it up. Um, but yeah, all the ingredient package in here looks really, really good. Keep going, keep going. Ooh, almost there? Yes! <laughs> yes, okay, perfect. So now we have 400 milliliter of water in this clear tub right here. And how about in this? Uh, the next one right here, okay, so I'll put the number five heating package, okay, number five heating package. Inside. Inside, so you gotta open it up. Do we have to shake it? No, no, not at all. So you put the number five heating bag at the bottom of the first box. Okay, cool. Oh, so this is what it looks like here. So if you guys have ever seen an MRE, like Army Ready Eating Mill, um, this is a heating agent right here. You just put it at the bottom of the first outside container, and then you pour in 250 milliliter of water. Oh, so there's a line right here too. Okay. Yeah, so on the inside of the first box, there's actually a line that tells you where 250 milliliter water is at. All right, so the water's going inside of there. And what you wanna do next here is you wanna put this clear bowl on top of the inside there. Oh, very cool. Oh, oh, so ooh, it's like puffing up already. So you have to do it within 10 seconds. You wanna burn right. yourself. Okay, so you put it on the inside right there. And then you have to put the cap on the inside. Oh, oh, okay, cool. And that's it. So all you have to do here now is you have to wait 15 minutes for it to steam up and cook the meal on the inside. Dude, we're making the hot pot right now. No, check out. That thing is steaming up inside the bowl. Dang. Instant self-heating hot pot. This that's, is crazy. That's wild. It's been about 15 minutes so far. Let's see what it looks like on the inside. Ooh. 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 The smell is so yes. good. Yes. All right. So we could dig in now? No, let's actually just mix it up here. Okay. Oh, I think the noodles didn't cook like all the way through. Oh no, the bottom one's fine though. Yeah, just... So just gotta put it at the bottom mm -hmm. here, but it does look steamy. Mm. All the vegetables look very cooked and plumped on here. Oh, let's mix it up here. So the spices definitely permeate all the vegetables, which is awesome. Oh, the potato skins are here. Mm. Wow, it looks like a really nice hot pot bowl. Ooh. How's it? Mmm, it's so good. Oh, dude, let's try the broth first, mm -hmm. right? So this is a lot of chili There's oil. There's a lot the of flavor. Wow, let's try the broth. And it's the spiciness kind of numbs your tongue. Oh, right. Wow, wow, it's actually really, really hot in temperature. 
But man, you can taste the Szechuan peppercorns in there, right? Mm. All the nice chili. Oh wow, that packaging mm. is so good. That numbing sensation though. Wow, the broth is amazing. So this is actually a portion for one person, but um, you can like, share it with some friends too, right? Ooh. I mean, after all, hot pot was made for sharing. Yes. So I'm gonna try out some of the seaweed right here. Mmm. That's mm. good. Wow. Mm hmm. That's a nice flavor in there. What are you eating? Mmm. The mushroom. <coughs> wow. It's so spicy. It's kind of crunchy. Yeah, it's good. And I think this one here is the potato. Mmm. Right. I love potato and hot pot. So if you guys never had um, potato and hot pot. Is definitely a must try because the potato is pretty mild in flavor and it adds in like all the brothness and it turns soft on here. <laughs> this is amazing. Mmm. That's so good. Mm -hmm. Wow. The broth. And the nice spices like really permeate the noodles and it sets up all the flavor mm -hmm. in there. All right, guys, we just finished eating the instant hot pot for Heidi Lao. It was super flavorful, super delicious. Mm -hmm. We had to wait a little bit of time, but I mean, Gina, which one did you like the best? Like, what what was the best thing about the hot pot? Honestly, it was an amazing experience. Like, the fact that you don't even have to use a stove to heat it up was brilliant. This thing is ahead of its time for sure. Um, the flavor is on point and the vegetables were really crisp. So yeah. that was my experience. This is made for lazy people. <laughs> yeah, 100%. If you don't want to turn on a stove, you don't want to cook, or you don't have access to it, or even let's say you want to bring this to camping, right? Yeah, this oh. is perfect for camping. Wow. Imagine you're sitting around like a campground and you know it's late at night, you don't want to cook something. Mm -hmm. You can just bring this here, pour a little bit of water, and it's self-heating, self-containing. There's no stove needed, guys. That's freaking amazing. That's a great idea. I'm going to definitely bring this to my next festival. Cool. Thank you guys so much for tuning to the episode of Snack and Smack where we chat at the Instant Hot Pot. Thank you so much to our guest, Gina. Where can they find you? Later, guys. You can find me on uh, Instagram at lovegina. L-L-O-V-E-G-I-N-A. We're gonna definitely going to leave in the comments below, guys. Anyways, guys, hit that like button. If you guys have tried this out before, leave in the comments below of different flavors that you guys have found. Subscribe to our channel, guys. Snack and Smack where we come out with brand new episodes every single week. And of course, uh, you can find any of our merchandise on our website, www.asiansneverdie.com. And stay tuned for the next episode, guys. Peace out.